Good evening everyone. We're more than halfway through the high school football season and one Delta County team at least wants to finish the season strong. In our continuing coverage of our high school football team of the week, TV 6's Lily Zhao travel down to Escanaba to see how the Eskimos are going to navigate their latest test. It's the heart. It's the 100% passion and 100% effort. No matter what the scoreboard says or how things turn out, it's what happens off the field and what you're doing with your bodies is what really means it to be an Eskimo. Those are the words that the Escanaba Eskimos have abided by this season. The month of September has been quite a learning experience, especially after close losses to Sheboygan and Marquette. But the team is now stronger because of it. I really like who these kids are because getting, getting a loss, whether it was a blowout or whether it was a tough loss, they know that they're playing good teams, they know they're playing good football, and they keep fighting and battling back, and I really like the character of this team. Despite a 1-4 start to the year, the senior leadership on the squad has shined through. Well, they're high breaker games for sure, but we just made too many mistakes that we couldn't, but we uh, move on and get better. We're at 98 cents of a dollar and we just got to find the extra two cents and we just got to get it through practice and we got to come out and play. The Eskimos are a unit and they'll remain that way this Friday when they host the Menominee Maroons in a big conference matchup. And Escanaba knows 5-0 Menominee presents quite the challenge. When you have two good teams in the, in the UP that want to play each other, it usually comes down to who blocks better, who tackles better, who does the little things uh, the best. The Escanaba faithful want wins to close out the season, and the Orange and Black are hoping to deliver on homecoming night. Lily Zhao, TV6 Sports, Escanaba.